Ladies and babies, welcome back to more Slappy Meats plays Bioshock Infinite. Uh, took a little, little breather between sessions here, and uh, I think I should have a handle on this now. We are without the spooky, unfortunately. But when we last left off, uh, Songbird was helping us defend this hand of the prophet. I guess it's the hand of the booker now. Uh, sucker. It was helping us defend this zeppelin from other zeppelins. Oh, look, there they are. Still just kind of be in there, I guess. Not going anywhere. You know what? I I don't want to have this rocket launcher or the RPG anymore. Of course, this isn't upgraded either. Ghost friend. What money did I have? Ah, 27 is really nothing. No available mun muns. So I guess let's just go to the bow. I was going to the right. Not the upper decker. To the bow. Boom. Booker, come here. What? What is it? Look, you can use the songbird to bring the whole damn thing down. Destroy the siphon. And that's what you want. It's the only way we'll find the truth. Got my finger, Comstock, everything. Everything, huh? You're the boss game. So what was I what was I positing? Something about uh, her losing her finger to pay for Booker's gambling debts. It's pretty common, you know, loan shark slash mob enforcer slash protection slash we're serious now tactic. Tear it down. Tear it all down. <laughs> Tear it all down. Get it, birdie. That was a The Whistler! Elizabeth! The bird, Elizabeth! I lost control! He's coming! No, he isn't. Nope. Where is he? Yep. Where is he? Oh shit. I was just starting to like him. It's okay. It's alright. I'm here. Just let go. There you go. There you go. Whew. That is cold. I'm sorry. I guess that eerily soothing kind of coldness and calmness. What is this place? Elizabeth. Hey! It's a doorway. One of many. What? This way. What do you mean it's a doorway? Where are you going? What the? Oh, come on. Yes, it's this way. What Comstock said about your finger. Is there an answer here? Do you... Down here! Uh, yeah, hold hold on, hold on. This is just getting, this is just starting to get funky. We gonna run into Atlas? Yep. Over here, Booker. I'm coming. Shit. This is the first room? As soon as you step out of the bathosphere? We're in 1940? Oh well. It looks like shit's already started going to shit, so... She took us right back to the first game? Ah. What? Okay. 
can't loot anything. Denied. This is where we have to go. Why? What is going on? Elizabeth, what do you mean this is a doorway? I'll have to show you. Yes, please. Do go on. Probably gonna regret this. I just saw an ad for Adam. An Adam ad. City at the bottom of the ocean. <laughs> Ridiculous. Booker, really? You serious with this? Where were you just? Looks pretty nice. of doors opening all at once huh my god they're beautiful what, the stars are you uh you doing okay come on come on it's this way have you just pulled a river on. tam on me we're gonna have to put you down because we can't be having the river tams. Are you going to open it? <sighs> it's no good. OP MacGuffin. I thought once we were here, I, I could fully control it. I, I thought. <sighs> what is that? It's a key. Where did it come from? It's this? always been there. I just. The I wish just fulfillment. Now that the cipher's gone, uh, cipher. The siphon's gone. The powers are unleashed. She can just. Unconsciously open up tears. Oh, I can't go get get swimming. Some mighty answers going. Oh, hi. See, not stars. They're doors. Doors to to everywhere. All that's left is the choosing. What? What does it say the objective is? It doesn't. What are all these lighthouses? Why are we... Who are... There are a million, uh, million worlds. All different. All similar. Constants and variables. What? So I, so I choose? There's always a man. There's always a city. Huh. How do you know this? I can see them through the doors. You, me, Columbia, Songbird. Sometimes something's different. Yet the same. Constants and variables. Yes. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. Build all these bridges. So, you know so damn much, uh, what, oh. Oh, Jesus. What are the, uh, what are the repercussions for choosing any one of these? Are there? Oh. Swim in different oceans, but land on the same shore. It always starts with a lighthouse. I, I don't understand. We don't need I did to. mention that, I guess. It'll happen all the same. Why? Because it does. Because it has. Because it will. There are so many choices. God damn it, the Elizabeth. Place. Where it started. No one tells me where to go. Booker. We've already been.
Are you talking about fate? Are you talking about string theory? Are you talking about decisions? The illusion of choice? The importance of choice? The cyclical nature of choice? Causality? Singularity? Is that us straight up? see us and other no how many uh how many forks in the road were there are we in Gurren Lagen space right now are you are you Madoka Magica I was here it was 20 years ago, right, right after Wounded Knee. I was looking for... Come on now, time's a waste. Why were you here? Are you ready to have your past erased? Are you ready to have your sins cleansed? Are you ready to be born again? Take my hand. No. No, I don't want to. But you already did. Didn't you? That's the idea. Ah. So much for the illusion of choice. Are you ready to be born again? I am. Do you hate your sins? I do. Do you hate your wickedness? Yes. Do you want to clean the slate, leave behind all you were before, and be born again in the blood of the yes. Lamb? Jesus, wash this man clean. Wait. Father, make him Stop born it. again. Lord, S Stop it. What no. are you doing? Do it. Get off me! Get off! Son! You didn't go through with it. You think a dunk in the river's gonna change the things I've done? Let's get out of here. Hey, look. These doors of yours, they're, they're all tears, right? We'll open one up. Open one up to Paris. I want to be shut of all this. Not until we find Comstock. Comstock's dead! No. He was here. This way. What? Am I Comstock? Am I a Comstock that lived? Or is a Comstock a me that lived? Uh, whichever. And what of my debts? Bring us the girl, and wipe away the debt. This is the man who hired me to find you. Really? Yes. The girl for the debt. And what, it, and like, okay, so we've been through this before. What debt was it? Was it simply gambling debt? So I was thinking for a minute that it, it might have been a parallel to say maybe this Anna was actually the girl being given for the debt, that he gave up Anna in his past to wipe his, uh, his monetary debts clean, his booking debts. And then she simply became a parallel. But Elizabeth is, is, is an analog to that. This. Speaking of Elizabeth, there's no, there's no baby. I, I remember. No, there was no baby, and if there was, I sure as hell wouldn't give it over to this guy. Booker, you don't leave this room until you do. Do it. What? Time Hold is on. running short. Bring us the girl and wipe away the debt. So, so, so in her, it was his. Do he was the one who wanted to change. Hmm. He was the one. Who was trying to convince his sister that things could be changed? So, so, so. Go ahead. No. You can wait as long as you want. Eventually, you'll give him what he wants. How do you know all this? I can see all. Because the doors it's her. And what's behind all the doors? And behind one of them. 
I see him. Comstock. What choice do I have? Well, right now, Thanks none. Paid. Mr. Comstock washes you of all your sins. So it was to Comstock. What power did Comstock have over Booker? What sins? What do you bring us the girl and wipe away the debt? There was no baby. The deal was I go to Columbia to get you. Booker, he's leading. So there are multiple instances? I remember. But I remember that. Now we've upset him. I don't expect this next bit to do much for his mood. Come on. Yeah, don't imagine so, Rosalind. What are we doing here? Comstock's dead. We can just go on with our lives. You don't need dead? To... You mean like Chen Li? Like Lady Comstock? No. He is alive in a million, million worlds. Because of choices so made? The prophet is dead. It will only be over when he never even lived in the first place. What will be over? What are we after? What is this what is this truth that we're trying to find? Hey, the deal's off, you hear me? The deal is off! Give her back! Give her back! Fine, are you mad? Give her back, you son of a bitch! It's ready! Go! No! No, no, no! So it is Anna. And Anna is Elizabeth. So now he's remembering things. Zunk. Wowzers. Plunk that finger right off. Okay, so I was right about one thing, in that it, he gave up Anna for a debt. But what debt? Anna. No. What debt to Comstock? I'm sorry. And for that matter, I'm so sorry. what if all of that shit that he was saying about Wounded Knee and stuff was true? That he was there, and that it was a different reality? From Slate. Anna do it with your regret then for almost 20 okay. years until one day a man came to you and offered you a chance for redemption a chance for us to be together so I guess uh, in a way I was close about guessing that do it becomes Comstock unless there's still yet more to go Just a, a vain attempt at retribution. Wipe away the debt. See, he's starting to put his story together. Wipe away the You're quite fond of this theory of yours. He's manufacturing new memories from his old ones. Well, the brain adapts. I should know. I've lived it. Booker, wake up. Booker, wake up. This is where it started. I saw you. I saw you. To your credit, you did try to weasel out of the deal. This is all Comstock's fault. What if I went back? Killed him before he did any of this? Things get set in motion. How would uh. one know how far back to go? That's the only way to do it. Go back to when he was born. <laughs> and I'll smother the son of a bitch in his crib. You gonna do that? You gonna kill a baby? Why do we keep coming back here? What would that do? What would that accomplish? In what universe are we trying to end up here? Like, if we're dealing with time travel, then we're talking about causal loops, and it would be the case that you smother Comstock, Anna never gets sold, Elizabeth never becomes Elizabeth, Booker never meets Elizabeth, 
Cannot go through quantum tears. Cannot do any of this. Basically, that implies a singular timeline. But there are many. There are quite clearly many. I'm still trying to loot, but I don't know. I'm just looking around for anything. Anything while I grasp at straws here. I don't fucking know! This is what you want. I have to. It's the only way to undo what I've done to you. Look at the whip. Are you ready to what be born this? again? Why are, are we back here? This isn't the same place, Booker. Of course it is. I remember what... Wait. Are you ready to leave behind all you're that has gone before? Wipe the not... snake clean. Uh, hi. Who are you? You chose to walk away. But in other oceans, you didn't. You took the baptism. You were born again as a different man. Yeah, okay, I was right. To have never started, not just in this world, but in all of ours. Huh? Smother, 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 smother. Before the choice is made, before you are reborn. And what name should you take, my son? The name. Zachary Comstock. He's Booker DeWitt. Blub blub. <sighs> but how does that stop? Other worlds. Because we were just dealing with multiple entities. D multiple iterations of Elizabeth that could travel through the strings. That can travel through the multiverse. As it were. So that one instance of Booker Boy. So about that being complicated. Man. And what about Rapture? What the fuck did Rapture have to do with anything? Comstock was an old man in Colombia. So that in 1946, that that wouldn't have, okay, it wouldn't have been the same guy unless he had been sent. But who would send it? Ugh. Still not sure what Rapture had to do with anything because that wasn't that wasn't Booker. That was you know some, some dude. Well, that was confusing, but overall incredible. I mean, I get what they were trying to do there. They pulled a couple of cool twists on you. Glad I put together that, that Booker and Comstock were one and the same. Uh, it did cross my mind before when, you know, time travel came into play. But you can never really tell whether or not they're going to go with a twist or not. But then, yeah, that does mean that, yes, Comstock was Elizabeth's father. Just not quite in that, in that order. You know, being Comstock and then Lady Comstock. Who was Lady Comstock? What a head-scratcher. But that is naturally the kind of thing that comes into play when you start dealing with the multiple dimensions and time travel. You've got a lot of complication to deal with in order to reckon that for a, a consistent narrative. You know, to, to try to reconcile all the hurdles that come with dealing with uh, multiple instances of, of a single entity. 
or does it become multiple entities? It... <sighs> Still though, I gotta, I gotta wonder, like... Stopping... Comstock from happening. You know, Booker still existed. And it was... Okay. He said 20 years ago. 20 years. Meaning that... Anna was... Uh, Elizabeth was... 19. Oh, Laura Bailey was Lady Comstock. Okay. Oh, hey, Jennifer Hale. Nice. Yeah, I thought that uh, I thought Elizabeth was um, Laura Bailey. Hey, Robert Atkin Downs. Yeah, there you be. In the uh, etc. Voices, and Steve Blum was up there, of course, naturally. So if I'm if I'm not mistaken, Elizabeth was 19 because her her growth chart it showed like age one, age I don't know 11, age some other age, and then like 17 I think was the last one, but that wasn't the last one that was that was written. I have to be corrected on that if uh, if I'm errored. Yeah, I heard those songs. Brian Wilson. Oh, yep, there's a taint of love. The arrangement was, yeah. Some of them were arranged, and then others were just heard through the tears. But, alright, so if the baptism happened, he said 20 years ago, if the baptism happened before Elizabeth was born, before Anna was born, is that what caused the other Elizabeths to disappear? See, this still doesn't make any sense, because they said, they said you, you chose to walk away, in other worlds you didn't. Why is he the only... Why, like, why is he the linchpin? Why is he the... the... the keystone? When she's the one... with such abilities. She's the one who can open tears. Why does she see all that? When really, Rosalind Lutes was the one who had her shit together on, on quantum physics. She's got her her hands in all the strings. And she died in one universe, but not in others, and could travel throughout others? Wait, she not, didn't really die in one. She was... It was Fink's interaction, or Fink's interference to make it look like an accident. So her quantum gadgetry center through just like jumping through dimensions like well like it's quantum leap but uh huh it's because elizabeth or anna was pulled through using the same my shoes hurt oh sorry to hear that johnny fawcett <laughs> too kindly ha 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 and louis p paws oh Protected will never be a problem again. Ah! My brains! This one's a thinker. I dig it. I really like this. Plays with the with the ideas of of causality loops and such and, and kind of eschews them. Makes its own rules to some degree. But works along the lines of things that are that are established as, uh, well, at least theorized to enough a degree that people have a, a passing understanding of them for fiction, if nothing else. 
Yeah, quantum physics is a... It's a... Controversial, I guess I'd say. Not, not really controversial, but it, there's a lot of uh, professional doubt between multiple disciplines of sciences and quantum physics. It, it gets a lot of flack. In fact, the whole Schrodinger's cat thing was was a mockery of the tenets of quantum physics. You know, talking like taking a basic tenet of a an atom be, being in two states at once, conceivably until it's actually measured. And tying that directly to some, to a, a macro body, you know, a, a living being, an organism, saying that if this atom can be in two states simultaneously, then this cat can be in two states simultaneously. It can be both alive and dead. And the absurdity, it was supposed to be taken as an absurdity. And I think a lot of people take it just as a, as a gimme. As like, oh, well then... Oh, that's the theory, huh? Fascinating. But dealing with quantum mechanics in in fictional works, they do play with that more literally. You know, they take it as a given and then work with it, as we saw throughout this game. How Booker was alive and dead. How Lutes was. How Comstock and Lady Comstock were more Lady Comstock. I'm not, but then again, I'm still not sure. Like, Booker died as Booker. He died as Booker DeWitt in Columbia. So they were dealing with multiple instances of Booker because he was Comstock. Hang in. How did he get there? When was he Comstock? This is fine. It's that one line I don't know. Outtakes. So I'm saying, went back home, Lord, my home was lonesome. Yeah. Went back home, my home was lonesome. All my brothers and sisters cried. Oh, yeah. See, but then now it's too short. He's, he's now Booker's short. Uh, uh, guitar hands. Yeah. Piano so hands. Goes, guitar hands. We'll play it one more time. Went back home, Lord. What is this cute? I have a lot of credits going on right now. It's giving me time to postulate about bullshit. Quantum bullshit. That's what I'm saying. Like, this is the second, that's the third, that's the fourth, but then. And I don't think that's supposed to say look. And I'm sure that I'm going to be playing this again to see if there are other endings, because in other Bioshocks you would get a different ending based on the choices you made. And, as I mentioned before, the choices in this one are, are much less cut and dry. It's much, it's much less of a kill the orphan or save the orphan. Your move, Booker. It was more, do you want to steal? Do you want to kill this guy? Do you want to not do that? Do you want to hurt his innocence or just kind of roll on? You wanna, do you want to do a couple of these things? Do you want to start combat? Do you want to split? A lot of times you don't have any sort of choice in what's going on around you, at least not that it seemed. Unless those, uh, maybe say Elizabeth stabbing Daisy was a result of another choice that I had made earlier. But I kind of doubt it. I would have to find out. This game was... Uh, I gotta say, rather incredible. I'm into it. Quite into it. We'll see if I uh, have the balls to try 1999 mode. Do that as an LP. I'll have to look into the DLC as well. The narrative was much, much stronger in this game than the previous ones do. first one it was there were some clever twists going on through that but like ultimately it was very simple it was you're being manipulated by some guy and better go fight him oh the villain's not who you thought it was whoa now go fight him so 
Second one, it was... Actually, I, I forget that one a little bit. It's not quite as strong in my memory. But it's, you're a big daddy. Save things. Rebel against the people you don't like you trying to run you. I do kind of like in that, that ending bit where they're running amongst all the lighthouses. I do kind of like in that ticker and log in, in the, uh, their infinite possibilities. Oh, he's got you in a Schrodinger loop. Oh my god. This isn't the you in this life. This is the you in that other life. Then that kind of raises questions of which one matters. <laughs> That's why I was asking that. When we're running on the docks, I was like, what? And that comes back around to why did it matter that Booker drowned at the baptism? Why was that the one that mattered? Why was that like the true Booker? Because that Booker saw other Bookers. He saw other Comstocks. That very Booker killed a Comstock, saw another Comstock, and that was back in the... <laughs> oh, that, that was part of like the causality loop where... Otherwise where Anna lost her finger. Well, otherwise it's just like an abrupt ending, right? All right, well, so, so let, what I want to do... Okay, I... You guys are mm. really, really, really good. Should I, uh... What I want to do well, is make it... This is going on forever. Well, I want to Should I just skip this? Down a little bit if we can. Um, and sort of start by finding, like, Booker... Can I get us this little, like, this little bit here to keep us going? Sort of oh, 2K special thanks. Are we almost at the end? Um, kind of figured published by 2K would have... Been the um, end. Usually, the publishing feel, credits are, so are towards the end. Excellent and professional. Yeah, I, no, it won't be like that. I, I, I want to make it sound like it's not like you know, sure. Sheryl Crow and, and um, right. Eric Clapton yeah. in the session. Um, so he gets Eric Clapton, I get Cheryl Crow. <laughs> Joplin, what do you want, Joplin? Hey, yeah, it's not fair. Yeah, uh, Joplin. Uh, he made out. Christina. He made out on that one. <laughs> Pretty Spears Lo. and Seal. <laughs> Dated. All right. So, tell me about, uh, wait. So that booker drowned. The, but that was the booker who had already gone through Columbia. Anna? Who's Anna's mom? Is that you? Really? You're gonna leave us on a spinning top? And now the infinite makes sense. I understand the title. Well, ladies and babies, thank you for sticking around throughout this uh, double episode length finale. Hope you enjoyed the Bioshock Infinite. I certainly did. Shit was a bit bonkers. I dig it. I dig it. It was a more of a thinker than I had even hoped for, really. I knew that Bioshock kind of worked on on uh, existing philosophical principles and uh, loose scientific ideas but I, I wasn't sure if I should expect if I should have expected this much uh, of uh, of like social turmoil and and the inner workings of the multiple dimensions and uh, oh shit I just I don't know I'm, I just probably gush for a while, but I will knock that off and catch you guys next time.
Will the circle be unbroken by and by, by and by? Is a better home awaiting in the sky?